So let us learn about the various types of the plantar responses. What are maybe the plantar response? You are going to just look at the great toe, whether it's flexing or extending, that's all. That's the most important thing. First, we're going to strike on the lateral aspect of the plantar surface of the feet. And if that produces a great toe extension, that's going to be called as the classic Babinski. And the area that you're going to strike will be on the S1 dermatome that you have to know. And you can strike on the lateral aspect of the dorsum of the feet. And you have to start from the lateral malleus and you have to go towards the lateral aspect of the dorsum of the foot. And if that produces great direction, that's what we refer to as the chadoxine. Or alternatively, you can do multiple pinpricks on the lateral aspect of the dorsum of the feet in the same area. And if that produces great direction, that's what we refer to as the bing sign. Then you can run down your knuckle on the shin of the tibia. Just like this, and if you see great toe extension, that's what we refer to as the oponym sign. Or you can squeeze the Achilles tendon, and if that produces great toe extension, that's what we refer to as the Schaffer sign. Or if you're going to squeeze the calf muscle, and if that produces great toe extension, that's what we refer to as the Gordon sign. And lastly, you can just pull the fourth toe outward and downward, just flick it like this. And if that produces a great toe extension, that's what we refer to as the Gonda Stransky sign.